Members of the South Dakota House have passed a bill that would make texting while driving a criminal offense, raising the fine violators would face. KCAU 9 reporter Lydia Vasquez talked with local law enforcement about the ongoing issue and the reason behind that proposed bill. She joins us now with our top story at 5. Lydia? Tim, the current law includes a fine of $100 to drivers who text on the highway. Now, under legislation and consideration in Pier, that fine jumps up $500, not just for highway drivers, but for everyone. Sheriff Lamage in Union County says other states across the nation are getting behind making texting while driving a criminal offense. He says it won't completely stop drivers, but it's meant to make people more aware of the consequences. Main goal is keeping people safe and. Uh... If you're distracted driving, texting is distracting driving, you're, there's going to crashes that are going to occur and, and injury and loss of life. So people are still going to do it. Hopefully we can uh, touch base with well, a majority of the public that will listen and obey the law. Shannon Larson says increasing the penalty to a criminal offense will make her think twice before texting and driving. I think if the fines are high enough for it, yeah, people will stop doing it. I definitely wouldn't text while driving if I knew that there was a penalty for it. That is something Iowa drivers have been dealing with since 2017. Although only a misdemeanor in Iowa, drivers are prohibited from using a handheld electronic device to write, send, or view an electronic message while driving. I think we've seen a little bit of improvement now that people realize that it is dangerous enough that they've made it illegal to do in Iowa and now South Dakota, that I think it's, it's helped get this in people's consciousness and make them a little better drivers. Obviously, there's going to be people still out there doing it, but now at least there's some way to hold them accountable for when they do it. But only if texting drivers are caught red-handed. I don't think it'll stop it entirely. That's similar to speeding. You know, you're going to get a ticket if you speed, but people will do it until they get caught. If the Senate, if the South Dakota Senate Transportation Committee approves the bill, then it will need full Senate support before heading to Senator to the Governor Nome. Lydia Vasquez, KCAU 9 News.